My name is Priya Tambe and I'm a sculptor. I've loved art since I was a little child and I especially love it now. In my sculptures, my focus is human relationships. The relationships between people and with our natural environment because after all, life is about relationships. My inspiration comes from many different places but mostly it's everyday people. When I'm creating, I'm looking for a relationship. There's nothing in my head. It's the piece of clay that tells me what to think. I think nature is a big part of my work. It's incorporated, most of my work has stone textures or wood textures because I just think nature is important even if it's a relationship between two people. We exist in nature and, and that's really what balances and harmonizes us. The mesh is something different for me. I started working with mesh a couple years ago. I've worked with clay and bronze and even fiberglass and many of the more traditional materials before. I start thinking of the form weeks before I sometimes make it. It's in my head, it keeps changing in my head, and then one day I just sit with a piece of mesh and just plan the whole form. And that's sometimes the hardest part of it because I have to plan three-dimensional on, on a flat sheet of mesh. And then I, once I start making it, it can take a couple hours or days. It's just once I feel the moment and once I feel the emotion, I stop. Transform is a very peaceful environment. It's also, a, it's also an environment where you can think and really look at things. There's no clutter, the cabinets are very well designed and they provide a perfect backdrop. There is no right reaction to my work. My work in some ways is a mirror. You see in my work what you see in yourself sometimes and it usually brings up very deep reactions from people and brings up their past or their present or something they're experiencing themselves. I've been an artist for 50 years. When I look in the mirror, that's hard to believe, but you know, it, I started very young. Um, it started out as a hobby, actually, and uh, I love clay. I just love touching it and experiencing it. And so I started as a, basically a potter in my basement, teaching children. Uh, my career grew with my children. As they grew up, I was able to do more and more. I started to do um, exhibits in communities, you know, outdoor shows, and then I went on to do the wholesale market. I really believe that people should be surrounded by beautiful things that they can afford, break and replace. So that was kind of my motivation. The classic tea is a cast piece. We created molds and now we created in the studio limited edition in several colors. It is poured and you use a liquid clay that you pour into the mold. Everything is timed, so in about a half an hour, you pour out the excess liquid, and in about three hours, you can actually open the mold and you have the body of the pot. They are then assembled by hand, cleaned by hand, bisqued, which is the first firing, and which is usually a 12-hour process. They come out of the kill. They are lined with a glaze. You then wait 24 hours. They are then hand painted, five coats hand painted glaze. They are put back in the kill and 24 hours later they are ready to ship. So it's become a very kind of mechanized process but and the pots are all identical in shape which as an artist was disturbing to me but as a businesswoman is phenomenal. Clay is transformative because it changes how you experience yourself. The work that I created for Transform was not the tea set. Their environment is exquisite. They transform homes. Being part of that was very exciting for me because my work becomes an addition to that element. It's a beautiful environment and it's all about transformation.